Now let's go ahead and just make our wheel. As you can see, I have my wheel, one wheel selected here. I'm going to hit Command C. I'm going to go to a new mesh. I'm going to hit Command V and paste that wheel. So now we have this wheel, and I can move it over to the side here to work on it. And this is what we're going to use. Now we're just going to make this wheel in this video. We're going to go through here and fix it up. Now it would be easy to go through and make a new wheel, but I'm going to use this wheel because I think it's a good exercise for you guys. I really do. So I'm going to go around and select around through here, like this. I'm not too worried about selecting the front because I can delete that really fast after I get the sides. Okay. I'm going to delete those out of there. Now I can just double click these, see, because they're considered to be their own set of polygons. And I've got that out of there. Now I'm going to go to my edge mode and fill that in by selecting it and hitting the P key. Okay, that fixes that. Now, let's go ahead and split this right up to middle with a loop slice. Count of one on 50%. And that'll split me right up the middle there. So now I'm going to go ahead, go to vert mode, and select half of this model and get rid of it. Now what that means I can do is I can mirror it. So I'll go to the duplicate, mirror, and I'll click. And boom, now we have our wheel. Might be a little wide for my taste, so we can bring it down there. There we go. Now we can select this, scale it up. And we can put it right into place. I'll go to my model quad because that'll help us line it up a lot better, as you can see here. Okay, now let's, let's cut that out and put it in with the rest. Okay, there's our front wheel. Okay, now let's finish up the detail of our wheel. I'm going to go to my polygon mode and select these. And then I'm going to select the ones on the opposite end here. And maybe these three. And these three. Now I'm going to go around to the... Well, let's just do one side at a time. I'm going to hit the X key. Click to activate the tool and I'm going to extrude these in. Like this. Okay. Let's go around to the other side and do the same thing. Let's see here. Let's do... I want to make sure I get the same ones. So let's do these. And before we do that, let's go to our edge mode and remove these edges. Now let's go in and select polygons like so and we'll hit the X key and we'll extrude them back in as well Now I hit the tab key, you see this gives us a great definition for our front wheel. And actually it looks like I went too far with those, so I'm just trying not to go quite as far this time. 
There we go. That's looking pretty nice. So now... It looks like everything's holding together in sub D mode pretty good. I'm going through and subdividing everything. Now everything's smooth. Okay, there's our front wheel, and we'll continue on with our pedals and front handlebars in the next video. Thanks for watching.